What's going on, everybody? DJ Goham and Mustang Man here. Say a minute. What's up? Yeah. So we are back at it again with the farm setup challenge, which we Mustang Man uh, so graciously named after we recorded the last video. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so, if you guys have not seen the first uh, episode, I will right in the top right hand corner of the screen right here. What we're doing is we're doing three challenges. One is a sugar beet potato farm, which we did yesterday. Uh, I was able to get it down to zero dollars somehow. Mustang Man got it down to hashtag 69. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that was two tractors, two harvesters, a tipper, cultivator, planter, solid fertilizer, lime spreader today it's either going to be a cow farm or an arable farm now if we did cow farm that would have to be two tractors one harvester one forage harvester tipper cedar mowers baler slash loading wagon manure spreader and slurry spreader it's a lot of equipment mm -hmm. or an arable farm which would be two tractors one harvester auger wagon cultivator planter cedar or planter or cedar liquid fertilizer and a semi truck with a trailer. Must say, man, you do an arable farm. <laughs> okay, I can do that. You said it was gonna be. I'm gonna get my little list pulled up. There you go. You said it was gonna be harder. So what we do is we just kind of hang back and we chat it up. So, so while we're chatting it up, trying to yep, 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 Mustang man's gonna be talking in his head real quiet, like, and then he's gonna blah. Tell us what he's doing. So I kind of thought you were going to go with the cow farm because I, I think the cow farm was going to be harder. Oh, yeah. Personally. That's why I saved it for round three. Fight. <laughs> so DJ wants to do that one first, apparently. Yeah. I, I got... Oh, I didn't think about that. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> I just wanted to see you do this one because you said it was going to be the hardest. You tricked me with your trickery. <laughs> okay, so... I'm going to go with the semi-truck first. Okay. Get that out of the way. Yep. Again, this one's two tractors. That? Is that considered a car? Uh, it's a truck. Oh, no. I know it trucks. There you go. So, so $119,000. Going to paint it. Oh, what you painting? Mustang Man Blue? Painting the truck. Yep. Lumpkin <laughs> Blue, a.k.a. <laughs> Make sure we buy this, <laughs> not lease it. Yep. And I learned that my what my ugly white color is not called ugly white. It's called beige, which sounds even uglier than ugly white. <laughs> yeah, kind of does. Now, what kind of tip? Okay, so for the fertilizer, does it have to be liquid, or do you want us to be able to do lime? So, too? so no, this is a liquid fertilizer in any form, okay. any way, as long as you can put down liquid fertilizer, you're good to go. So no lime needed. Nope, no lime needed. That was all yesterday. Because yeah. everybody knows you put lime on sugar beets, and then that's how you drink them. Nope, that's a corona. <laughs> that's definitely a corona. This is different. <laughs> <laughs> Keep it PG-13. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, Howard. <laughs> <laughs> so I actually don't know what I want to buy. So I think Ooh. I might just buy the trailer first. There you go. Like, I don't know what order I want to go in. Yep, I feel... I feel like when there's more options, it's a little easier to push it back. I think that's why we enjoy yeah. doing the tractors last, because there's so many different options. Oh, yeah. So we got Mustang Man Blue. Let's go over here and take a look at this real quick. Oh, yeah. So I think I'm going to buy the this, big, too. The I'm going to buy the I'm gonna buy in the Wilson Pace set. Oh. E4000. I want the big boy. And you went in Trying black, too. to keep my too. bank account even so I can get as close to zero as I can. And you went in black. You didn't mess around. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. ain't messing with that chrome business. Okay. So you've got semi-truck and trailer taken care of. Liquid fertilizer, mm -hmm. auger wagon, cultivator, planter or cedar. And if you have corn in mind, which we could say we're doing corn but we don't have to I'm okay with that so you want to say challenge? corn challenge Ooh, arable form slash corn mm -hmm. challenge if you guys hear me typing I've so I think I'm going to go combine next okay so this is going to be his harvester with corn header 
Is he going JD? Is that where he's going? Is he going big? Yeah, I'm going JD, but I don't know if I want to go big boy or small one. Ooh. Let's see, you what else do I have? You go I big? Have planter cedar, liquid fertilizer. Oh, yeah, I definitely have enough money to go big. I got this. <sighs> big is almost... Uh, big with a header. That is close. I mean, very close to a third of the budget. I would be terrified. But... Ooh. I mean, I'll still have what? Let's see how much I'll have left. I'm gonna go with the John Deere header though. I still have, I'll still have like eight hundred fifty thousand dollars left. Must say, man, what's your favorite flavor of ice cream? Uh, vanilla. Yeah, I figured it was. You went with single wheels. <laughs> <laughs> it was too, you made it too easy. Now it's not a joke. <laughs> <laughs> it is though. I love vanilla ice cream. <laughs> My favorite. All right. All okay, right. Okay, so there we go. We bought the combine and its respectable header. I decided nice. not to go for ninety thousand dollars for a header. Good. Good look. Good look. Which uh. So now next we're on to the grand cart. Oh yeah, fifty to ninety two. I didn't even realize it was that much. Holy cow! On to the grain cart. Yeah. Or. Er, not green cart, auger wagon. Auger yeah. wagon. Yeah, green cart. It, you, you're, you're we're American. Actually, no, no. I'm gonna go. Ooh. Uh, fertilizers. Okay, okay. Going fertilizer. Going with the liquid. So fertilizer. the crop protection ones are liquid fertilizers, right? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Spray right. or sprayers, I guess. Yep. Crop protection. That's yeah. it. Yeah. Any of those will work. Just don't buy so the first I'm one. I'm going to go with the small coon. Ooh. That was one of my favorites. On with the front tank. Oh, now look out now. He's killing it over so here. So I did buy the first one just because you said not to. Yeah. So now you've got to have a tractor that has front three-point linkage. Or do we want to At say least that? one. Is that You want to say that? It has to be able to hook up to everything? I'm okay with that. Okay. I don't know who cuts the back of your hair, but they did a pretty good job. You got a nice barber. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I think I'm going to go with the Kenzie 851 Grand Cart. So the small one. Ooh, pulling on my hard strings. I'm getting wide tires. Uh huh. There we go. There's that. Now it's time for the planter slash cedar. Or planter, I guess, right? Yeah. Is... All right, what's it going to go with? Is it going to go with a Vader strat that so, never works? Or a horse? Possibly a coon? Even Limkin. Oh, well, yeah, we still also got to buy the um, a cultivator now. Yep. And again... I'm going to go with the horse. Nice. Again, any cultivator will work. Uh... Anything will work as long as it's in that family and as long as you have tractors that can power them. That's the only thing that matters. So I'm going to go with the Amazon one because it also needs 180 horsepower. So nice. the horsepower is the same. Nice. Now it's tractor time. So let's see what needs the most horsepower. Yeah, you have literally everything. The only thing you have to get now are the tractors. Mm-hmm. So, oh, the Kinsey also needs 180. I did not plan that. <laughs> so, really, you just need one tractor over 180 horsepower, and then the second one doesn't even matter. Mm -hmm. Pretty not, much. Not technically, anyway. Yeah. Yeah. What's he gonna go with? Uh, we need the, uh, the the intense music in the background. The uh, boom, 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 boom. <laughs> What's he got? What's he doing? What's he doing? I'm thinking about buying a puma. Ooh, get the puma! It'd be so American. Two hundred two thousand dollars. Rear duels. Word. Mm -hmm. 
So how much uh, how much money do you have left? Four hundred twenty-one thousand. Sounds like you're customizing a big bud. <laughs> I could actually. I wasn't thinking about that. Let's see. Actually, no. I can't even do a big bud. It's out of my budget. Four hundred and you said you got four hundred twenty-one. Mm-hmm. You could go duels. Four hundred seventeen. Um. Let's see. T9 with the normal engine and triples give you 416,000. Uh, Fit 900. Ooh, I might have just found one. $420,500 for the Fat 900. Oh, you suck. <laughs> I know you're going for it, too. Let's see if I can find one closer. How's he gonna do, baby? Ooh. Nope. That's 500. Challengers, definitely not. That is a good price, bro. he gonna do what's he gonna pick what's he gonna get what's he gonna get and again uh these vi <laughs> these videos are in real time to show you like these are we have not planned this ahead of time this is very like on no. the cuff this is i mean it's we a challenge thought about it yet yeah it's a challenge of each other so we've challenged each other to like basically do this in as well preferably as little time as possible i'm doing are, it these are dropping 20 minute videos. 500 bucks left. $500. So Mustang Man is at 500. I'm at 569. 569. All right. Oop, not 500. 500. There we go. Okay. I'll let you delete everything. And we are going to go ahead and start. I like the direction that you went. I'm going to go in a very similar direction. However, I'm going to go a little bit different. Hope you're okay with that. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's see what you have in mind. In mind it is. Now, of course, we don't go too crazy to begin with, but we do have to change a few things around. We're going to go with a man truck here. And let's see. We need to change up everything just so the wheels and the tires, everything looks good. Purchase, yes. Next thing is going to be the tipper. <laughs> Should have had time to think about this sooner. Hopefully, I've got it all in my head. Uh, let's see. We can either go with the crampy, or we can go with the smaller crampy. Sixty-two thousand versus seventy-eight thousand. Of course, we're going seventy-eight thousand. Get on my level. Trailer boards, wide tires, bada bing, bada to boom. There we go. What you think about the, the purchases? I like how you said seventy-eight thousand, but mine cost eighty for my pay setter. Yep. <laughs> so I think you need to get on my level, actually. Ooh. He's so right. It's not even funny. Ooh. I hate him for it. <laughs> 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 All right. What's next? We've got that. We've got that. Fertilizer spreader. We're going with that next. Bam, bam, bam. Crop protection. Uh, you went with the coon. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go for mm -hmm. the hardy. That's right. Bam, More bam, expensive. bam. Yeah, just a little bit. Ooh, get on my level now. <laughs> so we've got the bottom Actually, line. Actually, I spent 3000 more because I bought the front tank. Sh shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Cultivator, planter, cedar, and auger wagon. All right. Actually, cultivator, plant, cedar. Auger. Yes. Yes, planter. Let's see. Yep. Planter is right. Wrong way. So I like the one that you picked. I do really really do mm -hmm. um though i'm i'm gonna go in a s different direction i think which one do we pick how much i think i need? might know what you're going with i need a whole lot we gotta get at least He's thinking one. of the tempo right now bam got it <laughs> so that I needs to go for it the one that never works 300 horsepower. Yep, the one that never works. So we're going to try and stay under 
300 horsepower for the rest of our needs here. Uh, cultivators, 500, 400, 300. Yes, a six meter. <laughs> That's exactly what we want to go with. Um, and then what are we missing here? Auger wagon. Ooh. Oh, that's How's a, your money looking? Not bad, actually. Remember, you still got to buy a harvester. Oh, I know, I know. What you think about them apples? Huh? Yeah. Went with the big boy. Yeah. All right. Now all we've got is a harvester with a corn header and two tractors with 300 horsepower or less. So you went with the John Deere. I support that decision, and I mm -hmm. like that decision. Unfortunately, I don't have that much money anymore. So we're going to go down Take here. Take the small harvester. Ah, we're going a rush on mash. Uh, and if I remember correctly, we can use the larger 12 meter on here. Though I'm not sure I'm going to have the money to do that. So I think instead of using the big one, I'm going to use the smaller 9 meter which is still going to cost us a pretty penny, but it's going to be fine nonetheless. Main color. That's what I was thinking, because the one, I had a big harvester, and mine was also a 9 meter, so, and it says that that's the one that works with it, with the little puzzle piece. Yep. So now, we've got everything we've got, $621,000, and one, or $621,100 left for the tractors. First tractor's got to be over 300 horsepower, and so we could easily go for something like a Massey Ferguson 87. Uh, we could even go with a T7 or an Optum series. That would put us right over that 300 horsepower requirement. And so I think that's exactly what we're going to do here. Unfortunately, I don't think it's going to give us enough money. Now, do we need two different tractors here? I'd say yes, because... We've all had two different ones so far. All right. Sounds good to me. So I'm going to go with a Magnum series here. Purchase. And then... Ooh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Right, right, right. Ooh, what's your uh-oh? Uh-oh, you're kind of low on money, aren't you? <laughs> My... Well, my thought process was that I would win, but I'm like right on that line. And if I get what I want, I'm, I'm going to be over. So it's, it's a, just kind of fight, fighting myself for, for money right now. You know, you know, I mean, you've been there, right? we've all been there. Mm-hmm. Oof. It's just. How close can you get? <gasps> Purchase! Yes! One hundred dollars! <laughs> okay. What you think? I got you in the cow farm, though. Oh, yeah. Hey, so you get to go D first for that one. DJ's finally on the board with one hundred dollars. <laughs> So it's $569 to 100. DJ is ahead right now. That's me. And, well, uh, Mustang Man, you got anything you want to say? Do you have any that comments? Was a game. You have any comments about my purchases? Mm -hmm. They were good purchases. Different than me for sure. Yep. We but try. similar process. Similar process. You got it. So we've got one more. We're going to see you guys tomorrow for the cow farm build. That's going to be two tractors, two harvesters, one forage harvester, a tipper, a cedar, a mower, a baler or loading wagon, manure spreader, and slurry spreader. That's going to be a tough one because there's a lot of equipment there, plus a harvester and a forage harvester. That's like half the budget already. Right That's there. like 800 grand. Yeah. Over, how, over we, half. how are we going to do it? Tune in tomorrow to check it out. But with that being said, I hope you guys have a great day. Mr. Mustang Man, you got anything you want to say to anybody? Shout out, city. Ayo. See you, everybody. Hope you guys have a great day. We'll see you later. Peace.